You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Item provided by Blue Orange Games for review. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and today we're going to check out the game Top That. Top Hat? Top That. Top That. And thanks to Blue Orange mm. Games for sending us this game to check out on video. Mm -hmm. Thank for, you, for ages two to, I mean, for players two to four, mm -hmm. ages six and up, two, four, six, who do we appreciate? Butch! That'd be Hey, <laughs> that'd be funny if they did it. Just two years to four years old could play. Yeah. If you're older than four, not allowed. And it looks like the box was painted by Stephanie Escape. I mean, the artwork and the game mechanics by... How do you say that? Diari... 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 Alright, so here we go. Nice box. Everything looks very colorful. Oh. I believe it's about magic. This is a magic game? Yes, we mentioned oh. in a shout-out video or a video where we showed some magic stuff and said... Blue Orange was going to send us this game, and here it is. Here it is, just like magic it appeared. Can you solve the magic of this speedy stacking game? Mm. Each player is given a set of magic props all packed inside a magician's top hat. When the challenge card is flipped over, players race to stack their objects in one single pile following three simple rules. Hmm. I like three simple rules. One. Objects printed in color must be visible on the stack. Okay, I lose already. Two, objects printed in gray mm -hmm. must be hidden inside the stack. That I can do. Three, objects surrounded by stars must be kept empty. Really? Interesting. Wow. The first player to correctly stack their object wins. Make object disappear and reappear as you dash to stack faster than the other players. I'm hidden inside, so... I kind of get it. I kind of get it. We need to actually get it out of the box, though. So when we come back, Butch and I will go through all the pieces. We will take it out of the box, mm -hmm. and we will eventually play this game. Magic scares me, LPS Dave. It does. It's the little bunny rabbit and the dove. I always think me. of uh, Teen Titans Go, Magic. It was an episode, I believe, that uh, they just kept saying, Magic. That's why I said mm. it like that. Magic. I don't know that one. Magic. Hmm. Magic? There you go. Do it again. A little more emphasis. Magic. A little better. Magic. No. Mm -hmm. Like, magic. When you open this box, is a dove going to fly out? No. Just pretend mm -hmm. like you just walked into a room and you're the act and you walk out and say, I'm going to do magic. Magic. There you go. Mm -hmm. All right, Butch. Mm -hmm. I am getting set here. I'm ducking. Ooh. I like the oh, box, gosh. by the way. I like that open. It's almost like a glass panel and you can see inside there's the mm -hmm. stack set. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see. Interesting, very interesting. So, oh, so one set for each player. Hmm. I like the hat. Sort hmm. of dapper, huh? Mm-hmm. Wow. And then here's one that's completely stacked. Let me just see if I can do that here while we're getting set up for everybody. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Whoa. I bet you people like magic will like this one. I'm thinking Halloween costume. Excuse me, this year, rephrase. Mm -hmm. I bet you people that like magic, magic, will like this one. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see. So there is a set of cards that they were mentioning. Remember, there's some with color, some without. So you should be just fine. I'll do all the stacking just so we can try the game. I'm going to observe and commentate. Yes, you mm -hmm. commentate. Whenever mm -hmm. I say magic, you say magic, magic. Mm -hmm. Let's look at the cards. All right, so I'll just throw some down color wise I see all right kind of getting an idea here there's ones with colors there's ones with stars around them see all gray and a star around them hmm. all colored and then one grayish okay one colored three gray this is right up your alley actually mm -hmm. one with a star around it so you remember all the three rules Rule number one. Yes. What Magic. Was, what was rule number one? Mm -hmm. Rule number one. Objects printed in color must be visible on the stack, so you cannot hide them. Mm -hmm. So here is the rule book. Let me show this to everybody. I think what we'll do is we will review everything, check it out, maybe have a little practice hmm. run, which we'll do on video, by the way. No, uh, oh, there's an advanced play. There it is. I was going to say there's no extra. Just one game, but there's more. Yeah, all right. Mm -hmm. So let's let's read through this one more time. Let's get it set up the way they want it set up. But let me take, let me stack these. These are really cool. 
I can tell if you're into magic, you would really enjoy this magic. game. Because maybe you can use this to do magic. But I guess this can go in here, see? Oh. So now he's hidden. See, that's what I was talking about. Then he comes jumping out of there. That's what scares me every and time. And it probably doesn't matter about order either. So you can do that. And then you can put this here, maybe. Mm. This here like this and him inside. Mm. That's what we need to figure out. There's all different ways does the hat always have to start at the bottom you know that kind of thing mm -hmm. and then like that so wow. let's figure that out come back and let's give this a gameplay magic okay butch it's always good to review everything mm -hmm. before you get started mm -hmm. now the rules on the box are actually the advanced play rules mm -hmm. because it says here objects that are pictured surrounded by yellow stars must be kept completely empty cannot have objects placed inside the regular rules say one of three rules. Objects printed in color on the card must be visible. Objects printed in gray on the card must be hidden. Mm. Objects not pictured are set aside and cannot be included in the stack. So that star rule does not apply in that standard game. Interesting. Does that make sense? Glad you caught that, OPS Dave. So let's just play it with the stars because I think it'd be more fun. Mm-hmm. And then let's just do a quick test. I will be the guinea pig. Mm -hmm. Here's my stack. Okay. Oh, there's a guinea pig in this game? Well, you know, that's someone who actually has to test. But you can help mm -hmm. me along. I know you have issues with colors, but mm -hmm. do your mm -hmm. best. Mm -hmm. Now, the top hat, when it's pictured, is actually a color item. Because all of your stacks start with that as your base. Mm -hmm. Now, a colored item like this, it must be visible. So i got to show it, right? Correct. Now, it doesn't say in any particular order, does it now? And then this is hidden, right? Mm -hmm. And then this is hidden. And then the bunny's not even shown, so we don't need to worry about it, right? Poor guy. So I would probably do this to this to this. Wow. Right? That easy, huh? I think so. Mm -hmm. Color must be visible. Gray must be hidden inside. Mm -hmm. There was no stars. Now, if it had a star, then I couldn't put anything inside of it. So I think you nailed it, it LPS. Let's try that again. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go a little slower now. It's got a star, so I cannot put anything inside of it. Correct? Mm -hmm. This is hidden. These are visible, right? And this is visible. Hmm. Right? Nice. Do you agree with that assimilation there? It looks, I'm still worried about the bunny. He hasn't been included. I know, let's find out what the bunny and I'll mm -hmm. do that next. Okay, so now, starting the stack, the bunny must be invisible, right? Mm -hmm. And everything else must be visible. Now there's some clarification like seeing mm -hmm. it from the side and other little innuendos. That's uh -huh. something you'll probably have to work out. But let me just read one here. Let's see, where was that? An object is considered visible if 100% of the object is seen when viewing the stack from the side. Interesting. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now let's try another one. You nailed that one, LPS Dave. I did? Mm -hmm. He's a cute little bunny, isn't he? Yes, he is. What did we name that bunny? Bunny. Okay, so now everything... Oh, tricky. ...is invisible, must be hidden, correct? Mm -hmm. So that's kind of like the starting point. Get in there. Get in there. Whoa. Get in there. Oh, come on. He won't get on top. The bunny is there. So that would be that, right? You got that one nailed up, yes, Dave. Wow. I think I'm understanding the game. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm only using a few things here. This is off limits, right? So everything except for the bunny. I can put the bunny here, right? Mm -hmm. And then this up here. But the idea is you're going to have two to four players all doing it really fast. Yes. And, and if when you, you're done, you yell, magic. No, when you're done, you uh, yell, top that. Oh, right, right, right. So right when I have finished my round, I say, top that. Magic. No, top that. Mm -hmm. Then I would win the card. Now, if I messed up, and let's say I did this wrong, and I put this under here with the bunny, or whatever was underneath mm -hmm. there, mm -hmm. this would be wrong. I would not get the card, and the other two people can still challenge to get it. Oh. So I got all these cards, and you got none. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do the next round. Let's try a few more times. I had fun anyway, LPS Dave. All right, let's, uh, I know. Well, you know, you're, 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 you're support, right? That's, mm -hmm. what, that's your role. Mm -hmm. Okay, hidden, hidden, shown. So let me get that, mm -hmm. that, that, that. Wow. That right. was quick. My card, 
Try one as fast as you can, OPS Dave. I want to see right, your fingers all right. blaze. All right, all right. All right. Faster! <laughs> it's not working. Faster! <laughs> not working. Oh no! Oh, come on, LPS. Dave. I'm sorry. Shown, shown, hidden, but nothing in the hat. How's that? Top that. Top that. Mm-hmm. Go. Wait, I, I quick, gotta, quick, 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 Stop that. Mm -hmm. Would it help to have me sitting back here just screaming at you? Like no, you that doesn't time? help. It, it, it gets me nervous. Calm the nerves a bit. No. Hmm. No, but it does help because it's nice to have you with these videos to kind of clarify things with me. Thanks, LPS Dave. So it's our first ever game about magic. magic. Mm -hmm. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. It is the game called Top That. Hmm. And I'm going to actually probably keep this one in my game collection. Yeah, I like it. Nice. Can't wait to play it later. You want to come over and hang out and have a little... Uh, Pizza? Magic! Magic! Hide Pizza. the dog! Mm. <laughs> what? In the couch, you know, when you get in there and... Oh, like, hide me in the fridge. The pillows. Time, and, all right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Later! Bye, everybody. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.